Hey, CJ. What's up? Hey, what's up, Jethro? Some cops are looking for you in the office, man. Tampin. All right, man, I got mm -hmm. it. Nice to see y'all kicking back. Oh. I wonder how your brother's sleeping, curled up next to his shower daddy while you lived comfortably on the outside. What y'all want this time? Well, what we want is to get on with our jobs in peace without some damn bleeding heart liberal poking his nose into affairs he won't even understand. The press on the uh? What the hell would you know about it, boy? Whoa, easy there, Eddie. Let's not get ahead of ourselves. Some young journalist out there is trying to get a name for himself. He doesn't know how the streets work, that he's supposed to report what he's supposed to report. Yeah, anyway, we need you to shut him up for us. And that stoolie, shut him up too. Yeah, there's some reporter who's digging up dirt on Pulaski. We don't know who's talking, but we know the reporter's meeting him today. Take care of him. Oh, this is a nice place, Carl. Number 
talk about the real issue in sports today. The loss of tradition. I wore a leather helmet playing football. The left side of my face is paralyzed, but it was worth it. We won the game. I mean, my boy goes to high school, right? And he's actually given a choice of different sports to play. And there's only one sport. I know, it's ruining this country's traditions and history. I mean, I want him to be a big sports star so I don't have to work no more. He can afford all the drugs and hookers he wants. And he's only gone and started playing lacrosse. Ooh, look at me. I'm carrying my bag on a stick and wearing a skirt. Might as well teach my boy to hunt butterflies. Okay, I guess you're right. No wrong. <laughs> it all depends how you look at things. Any race fans out there? Hey, any football fans? Soccer fans? Go home! We don't want to hear <laughs> Your game is terrible, and we don't win at it. Next caller. Hi, Derek. My name's Cole, and I'm a big racing fan. I tell you that where I'm from, there's... Can you live my way, guapo? Wow! No way, oh yes? You dead? Man, you stared at my ruka, so I stole on him. Check that out. I mean, that's why I never got in a rodeo, man. I mean, first off, why would you ride a bull? Go find a big girl. They, 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 they could use the attention. And, and that's all we have time for. Okay, hey, I'm Derek Zachary. Till next time, play safe, people. Go, baby, go team. You're listening to WCTR. Or maybe you aren't. Maybe you became so offended that the tight end zone has no female callers that you change stations. I know I would, and have. I'm not here anymore. Sexual realignment used to require expensive surgery, months of hormone treatments, years of therapy, and you still ended up looking like a drag queen. Now you can let the woman inside come out in the privacy and comfort of your own home. And it's as fast as this. Slice. See? Now I'm a woman, thanks to Rapidite. This do-it-yourself sexual realignment kit includes everything you need to go from Brad to Brenda in a jiff. It's just snip, chop, stuff, and swallow, and away you go. Do it in the bathroom and surprise your family with a new you. Comes with an instructional video, rusty knife and tourniquet, two aspirins, and 47 pounds of estrogen. It's all you need. When it's time for a change, you want it fast. Rapidite, the do-it-yourself sexual realignment kit. Be exactly who you want to be. Have you heard the number one gardening show in San Andreas? If not, here's what you're missing. Pesticides, exploring damp gopher holes, my new walk-in closet. What's on your mind about gardening? Tubers and, and root vegetables. Oh, God, not you again. Is it okay to cut the eyes out of a potato and eat it? Well, why don't I come over and cut your eyes out and eat you? What a silly question. If you purchase the Gardening with Maurice calendar, it's in the August section next to the picture of the firefights and the cute Pomeranian puppy. Yeah, I bought that calendar, but on every page, you're naked and in a different garden. A and the guys at work make fun of me. Well, listen, if you're ashamed of your human body, then keep your clothes on. I am blossoming in those pictures, and I 
wanted to capture the one film. But I happen to be proud. Got the same daddy.